This is a CBS 4 News update. Good morning, I'm Francis Wang. A fight between neighbors ends with one person shot and another in custody. This was in Westchester early Wednesday morning on the 8200 block of Southwest 25th Street. Police was seen walking in and out of homes in the neighborhood. The victim's wife told police their neighbor broke in and shot her husband over a neighborhood dispute. The victim was eventually airlifted to the hospital. He is stable. Police said that neighbor, though, in custody while they continue to investigate. A man under arrest following a carjacking involving a little girl. 19 year old Levinson Fisher was arrested on Tuesday. Police say he was seen on surveillance video at this Chevron at Northwest 10th Avenue and Sunrise Boulevard. According to police, he walked out and got into this running car with a child inside. He eventually dumped the car and ran off. The child was safely found and recovered. Fisher now charged with kidnapping and carjacking. Now a new video this morning of what looks like another movie shoot in South Florida with cops chasing the bad guys on a boat. But this is the real deal. It's what happened before a big drug bust that we first told you about on Monday. Bell Harbor police chased the boat into the marina. The four on board ran off. Two of them found, as was 36 bales of marijuana found on the boat. Later gator all back to normal this morning in a southwest Miami-Dade neighborhood. A gator was trapped for days in the storm drain. The Florida Fish and Wildlife Conservation Commission responded on Tuesday to remove the gator, but it wasn't easy. Public Works had to use water pumps to push water through the storm drain, sending the gator into a canal. Now, CBS4 weather with meteorologist Lisette Gonzalez. Happy Wednesday. It's a nice start out there. Warm and dry as we look from our rusty Pelican camera. It has been quiet on radar and later on storms will develop highs climb to the low 90s, feeling like the upper 90s and hundreds as we head into later this morning and this afternoon. Storms could produce heavy downpours, flooding, lightning and gusty winds, especially as we get into run dismissal time for students and for the evening rush could be very soggy and messy just like the past few days. So take your umbrella with you in the tropics. A disturbance in the Gulf of Mexico does have a medium potential of development as it lifts towards the northeast and across the Florida panhandle in the southeast. Hurricane Larry is a category three and forecast to move just to the eastern near Bermuda. Tropical storm watch in place there for us. Afternoon storms fire up again tomorrow. The rain chance a little lower heading into Friday and through the weekend. An ocean breeze will lead to the potential to some morning showers into the early afternoon and highs around 90 degrees. Francis. Lisa, thank you. That's our news update for now. You can always find us on CBSMiami.com and make sure to tune in to CBS 4 News at 5, 6, 7 and 11 for all of today's important headlines.